Hi, my name's Kit. I'm an investigative reporter with Bloomberg. We are producing more plastic than ever and it has to go somewhere. So it's very important to know what happens to this stuff after we've finished using it. I noticed at my local Tesco superstore that these white boxes has appeared. I wanted to find an electronic way to follow this stuff so I could be absolutely sure. I mean, the most important exercise for the purposes of this project was to find out what happened to the bad plastic. So we've just seen a red unmarked lorry and we're going to follow it for a while. I had three digital trackers placed in, in wrappers or bags and put into the Tesco boxes, which said they were going to recycle them. Yeah, they started to move uh, within three or four days of, of me dropping them off and I could see them moving by truck. Um, one of them went to East London and then sort of disappeared into what looked like the banks of the Thames. But the two other ones took a pretty clear path, which was to go to these, these Tesco logistics centers, uh, you know, on the outskirts of London. And then they both headed for the same port, which is Harwich International. And the next time I saw them was when they were in the Netherlands and heading east. They didn't stay long in the Netherlands. They passed through very quickly. And then they, uh, you know, went on a German motorway and zipped across the country in, in the space of sort of 12 to 24 hours. And uh, finally they crossed the border into Poland and I could see that both digital trackers, although this happened on different days, ended up at precisely the same spot. This is the Eurokey site in Jelona Gora. The tracker inside the Tesco plastic bag stopped pinging when it arrived in Jelona Gora. And then when I got back from Poland, um, I was surprised to see it, its location had changed uh, and it gave its location as southern Turkey in an industrial estate. There was no plastic recycling company nearby that we could identify. We sent a journalist to the ground and visit this site. What she found outside a warehouse just, just left in a big pile was tons and tons of waste from plastic waste from around Europe. The facility itself wasn't a recycling facility. It was obviously just left there before it could be moved somewhere else. I don't have any idea what happened to the, the tracker material that went to that industrial estate in Turkey, but we know that Tesco uh, waste material has been found in that very area, you know, for a long period of time.